everyone welcome back to Simbright Fashion Academy YouTube channel for another interesting tutorial so today's tutorial will be focusing on the, this uh, beautiful uh, dress on the thumbnail right there so I want to show you how to make this dress okay the upper part of this dress and then you can join the lower part of it anything you wish to join to the lower part you can make so right here i've already drawn my basic bodice pattern as you can see and i've done the necessary things we are supposed to do the necessary lines which is our chest line the bust point under bust point and the waistline okay so if you don't know how to make a basic bodies please you need to watch our basic bodies videos right here on this channel all right people so it's high time to start this tutorial right away and if you are new to this channel please kindly subscribe turn on your notification bell to receive videos like this every day like this video share to family and friends and drop your comments on the comment section and your suggestions as well so here in this video you can see i have my basic bodice pattern and i've divided my shoulder seam line by two and connected to the bust point which is the first thing you need to do and secondly i've taken my bust point and under bust point radius from this point i placed my under bust point line and under bust and i took it all around and made a circle with it so the first thing we want to do is the cape we want to draft out the cape which is the main business of this tutorial we are going to draft out the cape and then we'll start the construction of our busty so for this particular cape i want to create the neckline first which will serve as a guide for us so from the bust point now i have my bust radius fall on this point and i'm going to uh, construct this particular cape right here sorry the neckline that carries the cape right here on the chest line by the center front so i'll be placing my ruler in this manner to form the neckline so from this point i connect to form my neckline and to complete this neckline i'll also place my ruler from that point I love to place it, you know, uh, to run into the armhole like this. So we don't need to replace our darts at any point. So people, normally you contour your under, your upper bust. So to contour the over bust, I'm using this part of my tape because the beginning is not actually good. So I'll go in by 0 0.75. I'll come out by 0 0.75. So once that is done, I'm going to connect what I have right here to the bust point. I flip my ruler this way so I'll be able to contour my over bust. So this is my over bust contour. But the main business of this tutorial is actually the cape. So for the cape construction, this is the natural neckline. You know how you get the, your natural neckline. Bust divided by 12 will give you the width and the depth of your natural front neckline. So right from this point, I'm going to come in by 0 0.75. That is 3 quarter. Then I will come from this line. I'm going to come in by another 0 0.75. And from this line, I'm going to come in by another 0 0.75. So that is how the cape is going to be constructed. So I place my pattern ruler from this 0 0.75 to this other 0 0.75. And then I've created the first cape construction. Now I'll come down to... Uh, okay, before we come down to that point, this particular dart leg, sorry, this particular overboss dart, I'm going to make sure my cape goes into that point. You can see how I place my pattern ruler. So I will connect. Can you see that? So I've connected that. And then I'm going to connect it to the center boss dart. 
So I'll place my pattern ruler once again. Okay. All right. So I I want to make some adjustments. Okay. Let me just make some adjustments to this. So I have. Uh, the cape have a wider coverage to this point so this is what i want to do in my adjustment so from here to here okay because i need the cape to you know have a bolder coverage as you can see so i cancel these lines right now i just take them off and it does not matter and it does not affect anything then i'll turn my pattern ruler this way so i'll be able to get this cape wider to this point okay so everything we have right here everything we have right here is the cape the part i'm dot i'm dotting right now all of them are the cape so simply i'm going to trace out this cape I'll be using my tracing wheel to trace out this cape. So I'll place another brown pepper below. And I'm going to trace with my tracing wheel. As you can see, I'm tracing it right. This is how I trace. I go into the armhole. I come out to the shoulder seam line. Once I get here, I come over here. Okay, so doing that, I've traced out my cape. So this is my case.